Hello, I'm Dr Julie Christie. I'm a consultant in obstetrics and gynaecology and clinical director for women's services in Teesside. Hi, I'm Michelle Carter and I am an Angus based community midwife. We are here to provide an update for pregnant women and those attending gynaecology services in NHS Teesside in response to the coronavirus pandemic. You may be feeling anxious and scared and we would like to reassure you that we continue to provide a safe service and ensure you and your family will receive the best possible care. We continue to offer a full maternity service with 24 hour triage. If you are worried about pain, bleeding, reduced movements or any other concern, please contact us for advice and review. The gynaecology service also continues to offer emergency and urgent care to women. Although pregnant women have been identified as a vulnerable group, these women do not appear to be any more susceptible to the effects of coronavirus than the general population. The risk for any healthy pregnant woman coming to harm or dying as a result of coronavirus is extremely low. We have introduced a number of measures to ensure that it's safe for you to attend our services throughout Tayside. Any patient suspected of having coronavirus will enter Nine Wells Hospital through a separate entrance and be cared for in a contained part of the hospital. All pregnant women with confirmed or suspected coronavirus are advised to access the maternity unit through a, a, through a designated entrance and are treated in a separate area for pregnant women only. In Nine Wells Hospital, the main entrance will be used by patients who have no symptoms of coronavirus. You will be contacted by telephone the day before any planned hospital appointment and will be asked questions about symptoms of coronavirus. You wish to know if you or any of your contacts had a cough, temperature or new loss of smell. You will be asked these questions again and have your temperature taken when you arrive for your appointment. If you develop any of these symptoms, please call us before you come to the hospital to let us know and we can decide whether your appointment can be delayed. Staff in all clinical areas will now be wearing a mask, apron and gloves when within two metres of you. It is important for pregnant women to attend antenatal clinics and ultrasound appointments and we encourage women to come. We continue to offer a full pregnancy ultrasound scan service. Unfortunately, partners will not be able to attend the antenatal clinic or the scan appointments. However, we will encourage women to take a short video of their scan on their phones, which they can share with their family. Partners are welcome to attend during labour and birth in either Dundee Midwifery Unit or Labour Ward, including when a caesarean section is planned. Towards the end of labour, the midwife or medical staff will be wearing a long sleeved gown, mask, and eye protection and gloves. Sadly, we cannot allow partners into any other ward areas at present, but we have seen lots of our new mums working together with our staff to support each other during this special time. Postnatal home visits are also continuing, but again, the midwifery staff will check if you or anyone in the house has symptoms of coronavirus before attending. We would ask you and the baby to be in a separate room from the rest of the family during the visit. The community midwife will wear mask, gloves and apron as before and will dispose of the them in double bagged in your general waste bin. In gynaecology, all routine gynaecology clinics and theatres have been cancelled at this time. However, we're still continuing to see our urgent patients face to face, but with screening and wearing the PPE as before. We're still performing emergency operations and cancer surgeries. Some women will experience bleeding and pain in early pregnancy, and we continue to provide an assessment service. There are many women with vaginal pessaries for prolapse in our community they're usually reviewed every six months. We will, we will be contacting you soon to check if you have any concerning symptoms and can review those who have. If you're worried, please contact the number on the pessary booklet. 
Otherwise, we plan to bring you to a clinic either in Perth or Angus to have these changed soon. Many other women with problematic bleeding or pain, we can offer telephone advice and medical treatments to help with these symptoms. If you have bleeding more than one year after stopping your periods, it's important you contact your GP to arrange an urgent referral. We advise those who require it to use contraception. The Mirena coil can stay in for six years and the next one on road for up to four years during the coronavirus pandemic. Telephone contraceptive advice is also available via the sexual health team. However, we are aware that some women may find themselves unexpectedly pregnant during this time and we now have a self-referral telephone line to allow you to discuss your options. Please be reassured that we are here to look after you and it is safe for women to attend the hospital. If you have any concerns or worried about your own or your unborn baby's health, please do not delay in contacting us for advice. Maternity triage is available 24 hours a day. You can also discuss concerns with your GP or community midwife. Thank you.